Hey, what's going on, Eagles fans? This is Ariel Bedford for TCC Athletics outside of the Patriot Gym in Ocala, Florida, where the TCC Eagles, facing adversity, overcame against the Titans of Eastern Florida State College, winning by a final score of 76-67. to I'm here with assistant coach Lee Lavoie. Coach, at just under 10 minutes left, Coach White caught a play uh, which put Rashad at the one. The result was a corner three by Javon Powell that sparked your offense to get back in the game. What did that move do to wake up your team offensively? We knew if we could get in a rhythm offensively, hit a couple shots, we would feed on it defensively, and, and uh, you know, especially on the glass because we were terrible. Uh, we got dominated on the boards, but we knew hitting shots would help us on the defensive end, so it was just a matter of time until we got going. Talk to me about the play of guard Austin Grimes in the second half. As you were mentioning, there were some issues with rebounding all game, and it seemed like he helped uh, to delineate some of that with his play in the second half. Gave us great minutes. 50-50 uh, balls to David Simmons were unbelievable down the stretch. Uh, created some easy opportunities for us offensively. Um, and, you know, those guys played unbelievable, tough, tough-minded uh, minutes late in the game. Yeah, Coach, again, this is a, a very big victory, and, and you had to pull it out. You guys were down deep. Uh, how did your team mature in order to right the ship on the fly and pull this come from, from behind victory? I think a little negativity at halftime. We told them the truth. 15 offensive rebounds, wasn't gonna get it, going to get it done. Uh, finally got some stops and guarded man-to-man, -man and, and, you know, luckily we get some shots. Well, I must say, Coach, uh, the halftime speech and the negativity, it worked uh, because the guy showed a lot of heart. Congratulations on his victory in the quarterfinals. Yep, thanks.